gentlemen, guys, welcome to Smash Summit 6. Yo, yo. Uh, we are we formally here. starting the, uh, the tournament. We had a lit media day yesterday, a uh, bit of a day zero. But here we are on day one, and the festivities are officially about to start off. And uh, I'm joined by... It's your boy, Chun, dude. DJ Nintendo. My name is Brandon. <laughs> What's, What's up, Brandon? guys? What's up, guys? <laughs> All right, so that yeah. trailer was fire, man. I felt Yo, like was really I need good. to grab some popcorn. <laughs> yeah, Jeez. Yeah. yeah I nice like work. I like the, the production team. The the way they used. I actually really liked how they had chewed out towering up. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. In, the, in the letter. Yeah, yeah. That was, that was beautiful. Really good. So, uh, how I don't think the the viewers really know much about like the, they don't they don't even know the crews or anything, right? Like we, we should yeah. really break down. It's for been them it's been posted cool. online. It's been posted. Oh, okay. Post it? okay. Let's tell the people. Yeah. Let's let them know. The crews aren't. Yeah. So we got our information sheets right here. So we're gonna tell you a little bit about the events that are about to transpire. I got an idea. This is not important, but how about each person do like announce break each down crew? One. Oh, I like like right. uh, so you you say crew, you say crew, you say. Crew. All right. Well, starting off with the Summit Classic. Team Beer. Team Beer. Team Beer. Uh, Mango, obviously. S-Fat, Wes, and Zane. So that's already a super spicy crew right there. It's a spicy crew. That is a spicy Hella crew. spicy. Uh, speaking of spicy crews, uh, the Plup Club is up next with Plup, Wizzy, Two Saint, and Hungrybox. So that, that's actually Ooh. a very dangerous crew. There's two gods in that crew. Yeah. It's called Plup and God. Yeah. Two jigs, too. Two jigs, yeah. two, two jigs too, yeah. So that's yeah. interesting. It's like a Florida puff extravaganza. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And here we got now the third crew, Los Lefos 4.0. My opinion, this is probably the strongest team on the crew. We oh, yeah. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Armada, Beauty King, and uh, your boy Ginger. <laughs> First time being here at the Summit. That is a tough crew. That's right a tough crew. That's definitely yeah. the to Warriors of crew uh, right there. the crew. Belt. And then we got... Top tier, the walking contradiction. <laughs> we got Axe, Opsa, Hugs, and None. <laughs> yeah, the, okay. The character diversity yeah. there. You got Pikachu, Yoshi, Samus, and Falcon. Falcon. Slash Ganon. Slash Ganon. Slash Ganon. Yeah. The character diversity. How did, how did that happen? How did Lef and Armada and Mewtwo end up on one group? I don't group? know. That's that, actually That ridiculous. needs to be checked. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the commissioner needs to veto that. Oh, yeah, I'm sure <laughs> the NBA thinks the same thing when they watch KD play. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> that makes sense. So the first the first event of the day is going to be our, our character Iron Man. Yeah. And yep, there's yep. been some readjustments. You may have seen some of these in, in previous summits. Mm -hmm. uh, but the idea is it's like a low-tier skewed Iron Man where you've got to kind of pick from across the character roster. And they've made some adjustments to make sure that there's no – Cheekiness going on. Who did they say? Was it Practical, Practical Tass? Or was TAS. It? Yeah. So Practical God. TAS actually used <laughs> sampling data from previous summits to determine who the most likely characters people pick are, mm -hmm. and and skew the point values of how many you know because you need to you've 14 total points and you can only pick certain characters with the points you have. And he made the most expensive characters the ones that people pick the most. Right, right. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, there's there's going to be two players from each crew. Uh, so they've got to kind of decide of, of the crews who is the best character diversity. Uh, and two of those players uh, will entered, be entered into the Iron Man bracket. Uh, they should be seated, I think, away from each other. So they shouldn't be fighting until finals, essentially. And, um, yeah, there's this whole kind of list of it's, – it's, it basically mirrors almost the tier list. And they can pick one character from the top seven. So everyone can pick one character out of Fox, Falcon, Mars, Sheik, Falcon, Peak, and Jigglypuff. And then four more characters from all the characters below that. Yeah, right. There's a handy graphic for you guys. Yeah. Yep, there it is. So um, hey. there's two members from each crew, right, that go into that. Yeah. Yep, Who yep. do you guys think from each crew <coughs> would be the two people? Um, so I think the easiest one is top tier because I don't think Amsa and Hugo really have secondary. No. <laughs> so that, yeah. They kind of just have to go axe none by default. Yeah. Yeah. Um, team beer, I think, would actually be best served with Mango, but I think since it's Mango, he's just going to let, like, probably S-Fat and Zane do it or something like that. And then <clears throat> the other ones, it's kind of hard to tell, especially Los Lefos. I don't know. Well, Plup Club is easy to tell. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably, <laughs> Plup. Yeah. Probably Plup, Plup and Wizzy. Plup and Wizzy. In yeah. theory. Yeah, uh, HBox has got a, a couple secondaries, and then yeah. obviously he would have the puff. So, But, yeah, probably Plup Wizzy. Yeah. And then Lef Los Lefos, Los Lefos is actually really hard yet. to tell. Uh, <laughs> I that's no tough. Idea. I feel like it would be Armada Music King. 
Yeah, yeah. Even though Leffen does have strong secondaries, yeah, yeah, yeah. he has Mewtwo, he has Marv. That makes the most sense. Leffen, uh, if mm-hmm. you know, because they're going into the low tiers, Leffen like mained Yoshi for a time, and, and Leffen yeah, mained Mewtwo. Mewtwo, like so yeah. he could actually make could, it work. Yeah, yeah. make it yeah. work. Uh, Mango, so Mango, I, yeah, I don't know. Mango hasn't he played in these in the past? He yeah, has. he has. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. He has, he's but actually, well. I was just I was hanging out with Team Beer a second ago. Oh, and I, <laughs> I was trying to act like I had like a read on it, but I, I just heard it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at least you'd be honest, dude. <laughs> does Zane have secondaries? Is Zane a secondary uh, guy? He kind of does. I've seen the fox a little I bit. I was like, yeah, he's got a fox. I mean, everyone has a fox, though. Yeah, so yeah. His, his secondaries oh, are very technical. Speaking of um, the devil. Yeah, but you could only play one person from the high tiers. Then. Right. So, I mean, that's obviously. The, that's the tricky part. Yeah, because Zane yeah. is going to go Marth, and then he's going to have to bust some low tiers, basically. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah. might have a Roy. I don't know if the Marth Roy thing translates. Yeah. But. Yeah. Maybe. Roy has no points. <laughs> yeah. Zero yeah. points. That's crazy. <laughs> I Roy, guess. actually, I feel like Roy doesn't do well against other low tiers. Like, Roy, uh, <laughs> I think Roy does okay against fast followers, and he does not do well against floaties. Oh, and no, I feel like there's a lot yeah. of floaties. He does really bad. Yeah, I think floaties. he does. My opinion, Roy would do very well versus DK. Okay. Yeah, Link, he is good versus DK. Ness. And surprisingly, Ganon. I can see Roy. Yeah, Ganon. I can see Ganon. Yeah, I, can see Roy yeah. Ganon. I can see all the. I don't know, but DK washes. Roy. It's exactly. like Fox. Some of these characters nah. are steel, dude. <laughs> Who's a steal? I think Mewtwo's DK negative. for one point is a steal. Yeah. I thought, uh. Ganon for two, I think, is really good. Yeah. I feel like Game mm-hmm. Watch should be more. Mario for two? Are you Who serious? What? Yeah. Mario, Wait, Mario? 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 Wait, Mario's two? I just saw that. Steel. There's so many steals. It's Doc ridiculous. being two tiers above Mario. Yeah, how's That's Doc? Actually yeah, why is dumb. Doc so high? Yeah, what? Doc is super high. Some I, people say Mario's better than Doc. I think Mario's better. I think Mario's better, too. Ooh. That forward smash, man. What do you think, oh. DJ? You're the low-tier weirdo. <laughs> 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 this is your expertise, dude. Um, it's pretty hard to say. I mean, I love Mario more than yeah, Doc. Yeah, everyone does. Okay. Yeah. They're close. Matchup dependent. It's, it's kind of matchup dependent. Like, overall, Doc has more kill moves than yeah. uh, Mario, but Mario just has the, you know, more the, the movement, movement fast, the combo yeah. game. Yeah, you, the you know, his sure. cape, you know, you go higher when you recover. I didn't know that. You can wall <laughs> jump. I definitely <laughs> I did not what, know that. I'm yeah. curious what both of you guys have to say, because Brandon, oh, Brandon's a dog. That's right. Oh, no. uh, yeah. Uh, who do you think is better? I think. I think like it's like Fox Falco, whereas like Doc's more like Fox, Mario's more like Falco. In okay. the sense of like Mario, okay. Mario's more. You're always gonna root for the Mario. Right, if you, right, you right. see a Doc, you're just like, eh. You <laughs> see a Mario though, you're gonna be like, let's go, cool, baby. Right, like, yeah. There you have it. But I think I think Mar- Doc. I feel better, like but. fast fallers. Like fighting spaces and stuff. Mario has a better chance of beating, and then the floaties. Oh, there you go to Doc, because at least yeah, you have, like, down through fairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doc Hill. I'm glad we had this conversation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we, just got, we got through a lot right now. That's crazy <laughs> Doc is four, though. I don't know about Yeah, four. I don't know how he's worth twice as much as Mario. Yeah, that's actually pretty crazy. Above, yeah. like, Luigi and Samus. I mean, Samus is, like, Samus and, like, Pikachu and Yoshi and Luigi, those are, like, tournament threats. Especially mm-hmm. considering, <laughs> like, three people will main people in the three slot. But why is Young Link above like, t- Mario practical test, and Ganon? Labbed it out, and he okay. did the numbers. Well. He crunched the numbers, <laughs> and he said, "No one's picking Dr. Mario. No one seems to want to pick, or no one's picking Mario." No Young Links. Which is actually wild to me, by the way, because Mango's picked Mario every single Iron Man we've had. Yeah, in yeah. But I would think if, if the, the characters that are picked a lot in the past, they would be like, say, I would think Mario would be worth more. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or like, yeah. Um, who was a character that was picked a lot? Uh, was uh, it? DK? DK's picked DK's. a lot. Yeah, yeah. I would think he'd be worth more. Yeah. yeah. But, I mean, I, I I don't know. Maybe it is based off that. Cause... I mean, if Wes plays, he's definitely picking DK. Yeah, DJ, if him. you had to, if you had, uh, you know, 14 points or whatever, and you had to make a, uh, if you had to make your own yeah, what's your five-person crew? roster, what's your crew with these characters? What would you do? Mm, let's see. I would pick. Same rules. You can pick only one from the red. Mm-hmm. Let's see here. I would pick. Where's Pikachu at? He's at three. Probably Fox. All right, so I got Fox. Red is out of the way. Then I got. Damn, I could go a whole bunch. I could yeah, go. You got, bro, you got all the. <laughs> yeah. I got like the whole Pikachu. list. Yeah. Let's see. I'll call it Mario, definitely. That's yeah. the easiest right. pick. On so you're here. at six after Fox and Mario. 
I'm or, six. Or eight. No, eight. 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 I'm yeah. at eight points. Yeah. So you have six points left. Six points left. Yep. Um, and three characters. I mean, you used Bowser yesterday. He's literally Samus. Zero. Yeah. Samus. <laughs> yeah, Samus. Samus. Be Samus. So what, I have 11 points now? Yeah. 11 points. So three left. Yep. And two characters left. Uh, Pikachu Bowser. Pikachu Bowser. Yeah. yeah. That, that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. That makes Damn. sense. Good picks. You would no. win. <laughs> you would yeah, win. we did that again. <laughs> like with the like the Kazakh bag with this. We would Those all are all characters shit. you've made. Yeah. 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 That's wild. That's, that's nuts, yeah. actually. Yeah. That's actually interesting. Good you, thing you Bowser had zero points, man. <laughs> yeah. Keep being bad, man. Right. <laughs> Bowser is the best character in the Zeros. You, I think, uh, think better than Mewtwo. Yeah. No, actually, no, yeah, no, it's, Mewtwo's it's, it's fire, bro. Mewtwo's yeah, actually Mewtwo's pretty good. good. Mewtwo's, yeah, Mewtwo's so good. Mewtwo's yeah. probably better. Yeah. Than Bowser. Bowser's lit though, but it depends who you're better. I kind of think at. Roy's better than Bowser too. I, think I feel so. like Roy's like. Obviously, he's terrible, but I feel like he actually is underrated in the sense that people make it's him true. out to be I worse agree. than he actually is. Yeah, mm -hmm. he has yeah. good movement. Not that, he that has bad. Really he's got good, good movement. movement. Yeah. He's got yeah. decent combos versus most of the cast, just not like floaties. Yeah. So right. he's he not as bad kill. as people make him out to be. I feel yeah. so. I would put him above Bowser too, probably. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about Zelda? Zelda's, 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 Zelda's worse in my opinion. Yeah, you think yeah. Zelda's worse than Bowser or the worst character in the game? Worst character in the game. Oh wow! Wow. Even worse than Kirby? Yeah. Yeah, I would the say times Kirby have changed, man. Nah, yeah. <laughs> Kirby <laughs> got one point. That's crazy. That's, That's crazy, yeah. Nuts, yeah. Pichu got one point. Yeah. You got to spend a point to pick Pichu. <laughs> well, based, based off of like... He hurts himself. <laughs> based off history, more people pick those characters probably than... I guess so, yeah. yeah. Damn, no one really picks Roy? Or like, yeah, Adam. that's crazy. I would I be more likely to pick Roy yeah. than uh, the Because the thing is, Roy, you know, like Chillin was saying, he has a decent combo game. He has really good movement, an amazing down tilt. He could chain grab, stuff like that. Yeah. But then it's just setting up for the KO is Roy's main issue. Yeah. Yeah. And his main kill move is forts, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, you know what made me yeah. lose all faith in Roy? Shouts to Peter, Zope. Me, Zope, and Phil were playing around the world, and me and Zope are at sudden death so we're yeah. both at 300 i forget what character he is he's like falco or something and i'm i'm roy and i fear him and just like he goes nowhere <laughs> yeah, yeah and i'm just like yo really at 300 percent he just like it i was like yo he might as well have been at like 10 percent it's just like dude yeah this this can't yeah yeah, yeah. you can't make that happen yeah, <laughs> Roy's ridiculous. yeah. But I mean, these characters and like these guys are all good players too, so they could definitely like make something happen with right, like, yeah, with yeah, these sure. slots. Like, mm -hmm. remember uh, last year, uh, Axis Ice Climbers were just like doing they something. Axis yeah, Ice Climbers, yeah. 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 We're gonna see those again. You know, so you you just you just never know. A yeah. lot of these guys have pocket characters that just you're like, what? So, what would your crew be, Tiff? I would do I would do Fox. I would do. I would probably do DK. I feel like DK for one is a steal. I would probably do Ganon. Uh, how many how many points is that? That is nine. So I can I have five left. Yeah. I would do Young Link and either Game Watch or Mario. Uh, okay. Okay. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's, that's right. actually a good pick. Yeah. yeah. Well, and I, I think Young Link. I actually think Young Link has a lot of value in this meta because there's a lot of characters up here that he can camp. True. If you want to play like that, oh, like yeah. Young Link actually, that what are true. low tier is going to do about a camp Young Link? Yeah. <laughs> Get so, timed out. Not much. Get timed out, yeah. yeah, yeah pretty much. Yeah. Uh, Chillin, what would you pick? Um, Fox, and then Samus, Mario. What does that leave me with? You've uh, got, you, you have so three, three remaining so three, to spend. Yeah, okay. Yeah. And two characters. Mm -hmm. Probably... This is tough, actually. Yeah. yeah. You go Ganon um, Roy. I was thinking Ganon Roy, probably. Yeah. Because Roy, if I was going to do a zero pointer, it would easily be Roy. Yeah. And then I don't really want to pick anything in the one tier. Yeah. <laughs> so it'd yeah. probably be Ganon Roy, yeah. Which is, that's a pretty decent crew. This, I like the fact that you can actually come up with like a pretty solid crew with this. It's yeah. not, yeah. you're not forced to use like a, a fully bad crew. Yeah. yeah. Something reasonable. I think in each each quadrant is a character that uh, someone is at least somewhat familiar with. Right. right. That's right. true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, just like like how chilling. You just opt to go from like 
you're like, man, I'd rather use a zero character than a one because based off your experience. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I think that's yeah. pretty cool. Yeah, it's, uh, it's interesting how they set it up. Yeah, man. What about you, Brandon? You're the only one. Oh, what would your crew be? I was down. Um, Falco. Doc. Right. Uh, that's 10 points. Yeah, uh, you only got four points left. So now. I got four. <laughs> uh, Big spender. Mario. Uh, right. 12. Three, two characters left. DK Roy. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. All right. Yeah. yeah. That's probably what I would like do. It's actually not yeah. bad. Yeah. I don't, mm -hmm. Mario at two is still blowing my mind. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't even remotely yeah. understand that. I kind of feel like Ganon is too. I feel like yeah. Ganon does well against a lot of bad characters. Yeah. He does. You know? Yeah. And Ganon does pretty well, like surprisingly well against some of the good characters too. Like if you can, if, if Axe is running Ice Climbers, for example, and you can, yeah. you, if you can throw Ganon in there, like yeah. you could do some work, it, you know. Is there a, a sleeper character in like with, with spe within the green specific, specifically like two and under that you guys think is like a sleeper character? Well, I mean Mario and Ganon, Ganon, Ganon are like right, yeah. You know, I but see that. aside Ganon from that, I don't know if anyone has a sick Link. Yeah, I was about to say I think yeah. Link is a sleeper. Link for bit. one is actually pretty all right. Like yeah. like Mango's Link. I know Mango's not playing, but. Yeah. I don't know if any of these guys have a sick Link. Link at one is a steal. Almost in the way that Dr. Mario is two tiers above Mario, and that's surprising. Yeah. Young Link being two tiers above Link, Link is a little yeah, surprising yeah. to me. Yeah. I think those are similar characters. And, yeah. and like the context you said, too, like um, with Young Link, it applies to Link in a lot of these matchups just because, like, he doesn't have to really worry about the fast characters as much. Like, Link's really bad in his speed, obviously. I mean, of yeah. course, you got characters like Pikachu, um, maybe Mario, characters that can outmove him. But like for the most part, a lot of these characters he could just bomb dare. Like yeah. you know, just like yeah. yeah. And he, he has the kill strength, so he wouldn't be he wouldn't be a bad pick, I don't think. Game of Watch and Pichu to me are the sleepers. Yeah. From like two and down. Pichu. Yeah. yeah. Who would Pichu, you like yeah. who would you like to use Pichu me to King? against? Oh. Uh, uh, that makes sense. Yeah. Who would use Ganons? Use it versus yeah. Ganons. Yeah, Samus, yeah. I would do it. Oh wow! Really? Yeah, that's wild. That's, that's wild. that DJ insider. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what does Pichu never... do to Samus? Yeah. It's just extremely annoying for Samus to catch Pichu, <laughs> okay. and you I'll can't. just near him all over the place. Right. And it's very hard for Samus to catch me. All yeah. I have to account for is like the crouch cancel down smash and stuff. But if Pichu goes past, go past Samus, yeah. then he can't punish me. Damn. Yeah. I was about to say, because Samus crouched Pichu. That's crazy. And then even edge guarding Samus is good, because I could just throw Thunder Jolts over and over uh, while yeah. he's bomb recovering. Yeah. And then I can, oh, my tail always scoops up Samus in the air with Pichu. And right, I could right. do upper, upper Thunder and get a lot of damage. Damn. Damn. Uh, but okay. Nair, go, Nair goes through missiles as well, right? Yeah. So, yeah. Damn. That's hella good. Poor missiles. Poor Pichu, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then you got a down smash. Pichu's down smash seems pretty. Like it's it's, it's all actually right. pretty it's good. All right. Yeah. Yeah. You mentioned Pichu versus Ganon. That's a, that's a that's an interesting matchup. Uh, do you think Pichu wins that? Ooh. Because yeah. Ganon has a zero to death chain grab on Pichu. Did you know that? Yeah. It's, it's scary. It's scary. He down there, down there, down there, back here. It works to zero. <laughs> it, it's a death chain grab on Pichu. I mean, yeah, it's not zero to death, but I think it it's a lot of I think damage. it kind of is stage dependent. I think probably. it works to zero. I mean, you yeah, don't die, though. Okay, you okay. take a lot of damage, though. <laughs> uh, on well, Yoshi's, you maybe, probably Probably die. Yoshi's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pichu, you can't you can't really mess up in that matchup. But, yeah, mm -hmm. I feel like speed-wise. Like, Ganon really struggles with any character yeah. that can run circles around him. And Pichu yeah. actually can. So. Yeah, because I've done it before. Like, uh, there was a low-tier tournament at a Xanadu one time. I forgot what the tournament was called exactly. And it was me versus Red in Grand Finals. And he went Ganon. And oh, he yeah. went Ganon, I went Pichu. Went and Ganon I was just Pichu. going all over the place and he couldn't touch me. Yeah. That is a, yeah. <laughs> no, if, if, you stay, if you stay away from his grab, you're, you're good. Yeah I, yeah. I feel like the hardest thing for Ganon in that matchup would just be getting the grab. Because Pichu, yeah, Pichu is the so grab. damn yeah. tiny. And, like, yeah. if you duck, I feel like he can't, like, you're just like, <laughs> you're like a pixel on the stage. Yeah. Of that, right? <laughs> you're like Julie Puff. Like, like, I, I, but I mean, once you get the grab, it's probably curses. Yeah, but. yeah. yeah Pichu dies really early too. Um, so Do yeah. you know the character that I feel like, like how you feel about Zelda? Where I just feel like, man, it's gonna be hard to make it work. Mm -hmm. It's like sometimes I feel that way about Ness. Sometimes, yeah, yeah it's hard yeah. for it's Ness like, to get something damn. started, man. Like, he's it's not the fastest character, and usually. All of Ness's approaches involve a double jump cancel yeah. into like back air or right. down air. So it's, it's like, like really pretty obvious. It's when pretty he's obvious, approach, yeah. yeah. 
I feel like a lot of these low tiers, there's like almost two categories of low tiers where some of them you don't really need to know the character that well specifically. Yeah. But some of these low tiers you do need to know the character to actually be decent with them. Oh, Ness being sure. a good example. Yep. Uh, Zelda, Link to an extent, Game and Watch a little bit. But then if you look at like Ganon and Mario and you know DJ, Samus, you can yeah. kind of wing it. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Like these, the, the players that have good top tiers are gonna have good yep. versions of those characters. Yeah. But some of these are are actually really tough to use unless you actually know the character. Mewtwo's so. kind of like the, that. The double yeah, jump cancel characters. Yeah. Are all yeah. 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 That's what I was thinking. Yeah. No one's gonna pick Yoshi unless they've practiced him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like. Leffen might pick Yoshi, and like Opsa would pick Yoshi yeah, if right. he's going yeah. in. That's about yeah. it. Yep. Yeah. That's so good for Opsa too, if he was to actually like be in it, because then Yoshi's only three right. points. Right. Yeah. The problem Same for Opsa for is like yeah. I don't know what other character. What other? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, don't, does he have? I asked him actually because I was curious uh, yeah. what his second best character was, and he said Falco. Yeah. Falco. And yeah. Oh. Immediately said it's terrible. He doesn't so. play with the mentality that you can jump out of shield. Yeah, that's, that's why his Yoshi is yeah. so good. He never <laughs> he explained like Yoshi was my first. So like when we try to learn Yoshi, we have to break our impulse to try to do things out of shield. Right. But he started as Yoshi, so he is the opposite problem. Where when he plays other characters, he doesn't remember. He doesn't remember that he could jump out of shield, yeah. so he's not using that that's as an option. Great. It turns out it's a really good option with every character, <laughs> or even just shield grab, like. Cause you, I mean, you Yoshi's could shield not grab. Really a shield grabber. He, he, yeah, yeah like you could yeah, shield grab Yoshi, can. but it's not. It's so slow. Yeah, yeah. it's just like not worth. <laughs> it never works. It's it's no never works. works. Yeah. Or just even having a grab. I bet Amsa when he plays with characters that like when you Fox, you could just dash grab or Marth. Yeah, it's like he side bees yeah. more than he grabs. Right. Yeah. You, you can't <laughs> just like grab or like, and a lot of a lot of matches, especially in the higher matchups, it's like a lot of his grab punish base. So, I bet when he plays like. Falco or Fox, he's just like, yo, like, what is this? Yeah, like, yeah. He's used to yeah. getting a straight hit off a platform. Like, yeah. Maybe that's why Falco's the second best. Because Falco of the top tiers, Falco's like the least grab heavy. Yeah. Falco that's starts true. his combos off usually with straight hits like that. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. that's yeah. true. Makes sense. But yeah, uh, on the flip side, Axe is going to have a great time because he's got the Pikachu oh, yeah. for three. Oh, yeah. yeah. And then he's got a ton of points. The left Young to work Link with. for three. Yeah. The young Link for uh, three. I imagine uh, Falco from the top six, probably. Yeah. Yeah. Top probably. Probably. Falco. Yeah. Let's see. He would probably go Pikachu, Falco, Young, Young Link, Link for sure. Yeah. Is that already too many points though? No. What? That's no. like twelve. That's twelve. Yeah. Twelve. So then far. he could do a two and a zero or a one and a one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which I I have no idea at that point who. I he feel would like go. he would go Game and Watch for some reason. Um, yeah. Game and Watch, and then one of the zeros. Does he have a Mewtwo? I could see him having a Mewtwo because I could see Arizona. him having any. I mean, of these he's an extremely yeah. technical player, <laughs> <laughs> so he could bust out put literally any of these characters, and I just wouldn't be surprised at all. Yeah. <laughs> but interestingly, I think the the one character that he's very unlikely to pick is actually Pichu. Yeah. He always says, "I don't, I don't like playing Pichu." It's yeah. like not. It doesn't feel right. I mean, yeah. if I was a Pikachu man, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> I would hate playing Pichu. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So. It seems really different. Well, yeah. it is really. He different. might have a Mewtwo, you know, all these years playing with Taj. Yep, so, yeah. that's true. Yeah, or even a Yoshi. Yeah, I was playing about to with Vector Man all the time. Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. He can go a three and a zero, right? Like he can have like, he can have like uh, four threes and a zero. Four threes. So he can, or he can go like, say he can go, or no, he'll he'll he he'll be Falco. Over. Never mind, he'll yeah. be over. I forgot. Because yeah. if he yeah. picks Falco, Pikachu, Young Link, that's already twelve points. Right, right, right. Yeah. 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 And then, yeah, that's good. Damn, that's 12. Damn, yeah. That's 12. Axe is probably one of the, the favorites in this, though. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. I would say so. Along with, obviously, the gods. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder, out of Lost Levels, who's going in? Because, like, left it or modern music. I mean, like yeah, you we said, Mutant King's that. probably, like... The favorite, but still, like, still, yeah. I imagine it's Armada in M2K, but, yeah, I could see Leffen doing it, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, just because he is the, the Mewtwo Yoshi. Yep, yep. Like, that's pretty strong. We will see. When are they When are they kicking off these crew battles? We got five more minutes? I believe, I yeah. So. They're starting in five. <sighs> I would love to see uh, the bracket. Yeah. Because we have a oh, yeah. eight-man bracket for this thing. Oh, right, right. Shindig. Is this single? Single limb? Uh, I think it's, it's uh, Iron Man single is single limb. limb. Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, yeah, as is uh, the random versus random that is coming up afterwards. That is also yep. that is a 16-player single one. Yep, yeah. yep. Yesterday yeah. we did it, the caster version. The caster yep. version, yeah. There, no, not much explanation. If you watch what we did yesterday, the players are doing the same thing. It's yeah. the same rules. Uh, it's going to be best of five one-stock matches with random select, and you can re-roll if you've just lost. Yeah. Yep. Um, you can only re-roll once, though. Yep, only yeah. re-roll once. So if you get an even worse character, then you got to hold that. Yeah. You got to hold that. Yeah, you definitely got to hold that. <laughs> Yeah. So, and it's uh, only tournament legal stages. That's the only thing that's not random. Right. Only tournament legal stages. stages. Yeah, yeah, that'd be yeah. too crazy. Yeah, that would be too. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, yeah. <laughs> you could get really unlucky if you got like, if you, if you rolled like a mid tier and you ended up fighting like a spacey on Corneria or something. It's just like oh, oh, my. <laughs> nothing you could you're gonna be able to do. <laughs> it needs to at least be neutral stages. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm wondering when they're gonna kick this off. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see some jank, man. I'm, yeah. uh, I need to see. Some <laughs> you want to see some jank <laughs> early yeah, in the I morning? Need that, I, need that, I need that early morning jank, man. <laughs> are you the type? Are you are you guys the type of people that uh, for 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 Iron Man's and also for crew battles? Would you send in your strongest character first, or would you save it towards the end? I save it usually. Yo, I'll I save on it. That I'll put it like in the middle ground. Okay. Yeah, it depends. Yeah. Like I wouldn't pick Fox right away. No yeah, way. yeah. Because yeah, you could have an advantage and have like an immediate strong lead. But then you lose, like, basically your strongest counterfeit. Because if right. it's a really annoying character that counters, like, all your other characters. Like, my list, for example, was, like, what? Fox, Pikachu, Samus, Bowser. Bowser, and Mario. And Mario. Right. So then, let's say if it was, like, a runaway young Link, I need Fox yeah, for that. You just yeah. All my other it. characters, like, it's hard for them to deal with that. Mm -hmm. Mario can't chase young Link. Pikachu gets hit by everything and gets shield stabbed. Yeah. yeah. Bowser, of course. Hell no. Bowser, no. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> So, like, if I was to fight, like, let's say Axe's Young Link, uh, I save my Fox for that. You probably want right. Fox, right? Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, I usually, as far as the character that goes first, I try to pick whoever seems the most versatile in terms yes. of, like, the opponent's mm -hmm. characters that they have. I look at, all right, this character doesn't get messed up too bad by any of their characters. Oh, so, I'm going to start, yeah. like, if, if we were going with what I was going before, maybe, like, Samus, you know what I mean? Yeah. Just because... There's no single matchup that they could pick that would destroy me right. with that character. That's yep. usually what I try to base it on. Yeah, I think picking the least polarizing character and you like, so like, like a, a character, a, a character that you won't regret not having in the long run too. Yeah. Like yeah. so, it's like, say, like I, I might start off with like DK, right? Yeah. Because I know like, if I lose him, eh. Yeah. If I win. Like, yeah. it's lit. Yeah. You know, like, that's kind of how I, I see kind of like basically what you were saying, chilling, you know, but I, I just feel like, yeah, something where I know, like, if I pick this character, then yeah. I, I just won't feel anything regardless of what happens. Yeah. Right. And sometimes I feel like the crew battle starts in the second match. Yeah. You yeah. know, like, yeah, yeah, the, the first one's just yeah. like, well, let's just get this out of the way to right. see where we're going. So how many, how many stocks is it, though, per match? Two stocks? I think our oh I it per character four. yeah I yeah. don't know yeah two or four stocks. I think it's four but I feel like it's always been four yeah uh, mm -hmm. yeah four just adds a sense of legitimacy to it yeah that's yeah. true yeah. and yeah. if it's single limb yeah. eight eight man it's not gonna take yeah, it's not it gonna should take be that four stars so, okay. single limb it's yeah. not gonna take that long so yeah for like for me I would pick Mario then Mario's definitely like just to start off ultra middle ground yeah. Yeah. character I'm finding every matchup using him right right. Yeah. So at worst, like I'll take some stocks off, but then, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And also a character that you don't necessarily have a specific plan for, like as far as counterpicking. Yeah. Because there's a true. lot of characters that you're saving specifically for one care, one or two characters yeah. that you might run across. Mm -hmm. And if you have one that doesn't really fit that bill, then you might as well use them first. Yeah, so. yeah. I agree. Mm -hmm. It's like yeah. it's hard. Crew battles are hard, man, because you just have to like. Or Iron Man, I should say. Iron yeah. Man is hard just because you got to juggle in, like, what goes where. Like, placement matters so much. Yeah. yeah. So That's it's hard true. to be like, damn, where, where am I going to place what? And then you have to think about what they got. Right. You know, and you're trying to place it based off how they would yeah. think. Right, right. It's, it's hard, man. Yes. That, like, that's a whole nother mind game or, yeah. like, a matchup in itself. Yeah, it's right. literally yeah. your own crew battle. Right. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, know? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel like that even makes it harder than normal crews in a way, just right. because in normal crews it's kind of obvious usually who should go in in certain situations, yeah. and you yeah. also have the whole team to talk to and kind of figure it out, work it out together. Yeah. In yeah. Iron Man, it's just you, and you got to figure it out on your own. You got to make a quick decision, and 
the wrong decision can easily just lose the whole crew battle. <laughs> right. so, yeah, uh, it's that's rough. true. And then a lot of times in crew battles with like people, it's like you just kind of go in and play. Right. Whereas like in this one, since you're playing everything, <laughs> since you're playing <laughs> everything, <laughs> that was the most epic paper pickup I've ever <laughs> seen in my life. Um, yeah, and this since, since you're playing everything, it, it, it's kind of harder to gauge like. Sometimes you change your mind, mid, you know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you, you change judgment, like, nah, maybe I should go here yeah. and do this. Right. But then you'd be like, nah. Based off of the last match, you might you say you had an idea, and then whether it goes really good or really bad, you totally shift your perspective right. off that one game. Yeah. So. yeah, yeah. That's what Iron Man's do. It just kind of creates chaos yeah. all around. And then stages are a big thing, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Models, yeah. Yeah, yeah are we doing stage? Are we doing stage bands? Is it only the three big stages, or we're doing just every single? I'm not sure. Wait, what I are the three no big idea. stages? Usually, like back in the days, the crew battles yeah. used to be what? Um, it was a uh, battlefield, oh. battlefield, dreamland, dreamland FD. FD. Oh, D, I think. Is that an East yeah. Coast rule? Have you heard of that, yeah. Brandon? That's Wait, not back. That might be an East Coast rule. No, no, no. I've I've heard of that. Like yeah. you do the, the you ban no Yoshi's no FOD. Nah, you put the timer on 99, and then you just get rid of a. Uh, it's FD. It's FD Battlefield Dreamland. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I think to start off. Moves. That yeah. must be and before then, my time then because yeah. I, I've never heard of that. I think FD yeah. shouldn't. I think it should just be Battlefield Dreamland. Yeah. yeah. I think FD is yeah. too, too polarized. Yeah. 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 It should just be Battlefield Dreamland. Yeah. Like, honestly. Back in the day, we just loved FD. So. Yeah. 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 FD. Back in the day, and no one, like, like, no one yeah. punished like Mewtwo King. So like, yeah. you guys didn't know why it was. A yeah. FD was yeah. lit we before like, people were zero to death in it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's uh, what I'm saying. Like, yeah, you know, that was dope. Like, come on, it's the most even stage in the game, right? <laughs> the no Mewtwo King shows up and starts killing everybody <laughs> off one grab. It's like, yeah. all right, yeah. well. Yeah, this tape sucks. Dude, I still think I think FD now shouldn't even be like a starting stage. It, it, you think it's like it's like too different? Yeah, but the, like the problem is, if you get rid of FD, you definitely have to get rid of Yoshi's, because that's just as like you know, like eh. they just change the dynamic. Yeah, but then so you only have like three stages to choose from. So wait, you like, would change? Um, oh no, Pokemon isn't a starter. So you no, I'm saying FD shouldn't be a starter. But then yeah. FD should be a counter pick. Yeah, if yeah, yeah, you yeah. get rid of FD, you have to. Get, I think you should get you probably get rid of Yoshi's. Yoshi's yeah. And, but then you would only have three stages to start from. So it'd be Dreamland. That's too few. Yeah, that's, that's too, too few. few. Yeah, that's yeah, what I'm yeah. saying. Mm -hmm. Dreamland, Fountain, and uh, I think Battle it's Fountain. fine that it's yeah. on there because we have stage strikes. Yeah, I yeah. mean, yeah. like, yeah. stage strikes make it okay. Like, that's true. Usually it's pretty obvious. It's like, all right, if I play strike a space here. animal, I'm fighting a Marth, I'm just going to strike it. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the true. only time you end up starting on FD is when it's actually, like, a decent, fair matchup on FD. Yeah. Or like, Falcon yeah. Fox or something yeah. like that. Yeah, you know floaty matchups, too. Yeah, right. floaty matchups. Match a lot of floaty matchups. Yeah. Like you'll see, like, man, I remember Main and Doc back in the day and playing Peaches. Like that was pretty much like the go-to. It was just like FD or Battlefield. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I always got rid of Dreamland because I just I, you don't want to fight Peaches. Nah, yeah. yeah, and like they would get rid of Fountain because sometimes the space is too small. So it'd be like if it wasn't Battlefield, it was FD. Right. So I could see that. Yeah. You know, and I've I've seen like Armada and like. Um, I remember Dewan. They've started there. I think he started there, like a couple peaches. Yeah. yeah. Hacks used to start there against uh, against Armada because Hacks would get rid of Dreamland because he didn't want the big stage, and he'd get yeah, rid of FOD smart, yeah. mm -hmm. because yeah. he didn't like fighting Peach on FOD. With the theory being, FD is good for Fox as long as you don't get grabbed. Right. Um, <laughs> how so. would you guys? How do you guys like doing your stage striking? Do you let the person go first, or you like stage striking first? You know, in the the vast majority of circumstances, I feel like I'm gonna end up striking the same two stages. It doesn't. Yeah. Regardless. Yeah. <laughs> I think I think ninety percent, like ninety five percent of the time doesn't plus, matter. it doesn't matter. But I do think occasionally it'll matter. So like, yeah. it usually I don't care. But if it's like a particular, like a, a person that I'm worried about a specific stage or something mm -hmm. like that, then yeah. I might be like, let's let's RPS. Right. But I actually I'll like let them go. Uh, the one matchup for me that I found is it influ it's influential is against Marth. Yeah. Because um, I, if I have to strike, uh, well, if I'm fighting a Marth, like a lot of the time I don't want to fight on Yoshi. I don't want to start Yoshi's, yeah. but a lot of Marths these days I think also don't want to fight Fox on Yoshi's. So if they yeah. strike first time, they get rid of Yoshi's, yeah, yeah, and we yeah. end up on Battlefield. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But if I'm, yeah, if I if I don't get that luxury, then I have to I have to strike it to be safe, kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. I feel, I, for me, I strike stages 
more off play style. Yeah. yeah. So if mm-hmm. I feel like someone's like just going ham, I'm less reluctant to go to Yoshi's, even though I like it there. But then if I'm playing someone who's just more on the like safer side, then like I'm really not trying to go to Dreamland. Yeah, like, yeah. I just I usually just strike that state. Like FD Dreamland two states, I just strike in general. <laughs> yeah. I just don't like them. But like, you know, if my man I'm playing is about to be on the platform like crazy, I'm like, bro, I gotta get rid of Dreamland. Like, <laughs> yeah. I'll take my chances to get chain grab because like if I'm playing like a fox, I'm like I just get rid of Yeah, you dream. want that close quarter fight, like you know, fight. Yeah, me. but then yeah. sometimes it's like it's it's mm-hmm. it's it's difficult, right? Cause say if I play like a mango on Yoshi's, like I'm just oh, know, I'm yeah. getting socked up. <laughs> so I'm like, bro, bro, I need some room. You need some room. Yeah, yeah. 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 It, it's all on play stuff. Even versus like floaties, like say with like ICs. There's some ICs where I like I like to start Dreamland, and then there's some ICs I'll play mm. where like I'm like I'm down with Fountain. Yeah. Or like Battlefield, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah. That's true. Uh, it depends. Like how people play, I tailor. At least how I think they play it, I tailor my stage striking off that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always let my opponent always strike first. If you're uh, a real one. Yeah, just you're in case, one. like they might take out a stage that, that I don't we, like. That you were gonna strike anyway. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, that's true. So then yeah. I'm like, all right. So that's now I have two exactly. good choices. That's the benefit that of going true. second. I usually yeah. like going second in teams specifically. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. I hate Yoshi's. Everyone hates Yoshi's in teams usually, so yeah. I usually let them strike and they'll get rid of Yoshi's. <laughs> <laughs> they typically get rid of Yoshi's first, and then that just lets me leave open the exact two stages I want to leave yeah. open, which is usually Pokemon FD. So yeah. I feel like in teams it's better to let them go first sometimes. Yeah, I see that. I can see that. Yeah, teams is mm-hmm. teams going second is weird. I just. I don't know. I just strike Dreamland and then let the chips fall already, man. <laughs> yeah. it's, especially in, te- in, in teams. Yeah, I'm just like, I'm I hate Dreamland in teams. I hate Dreamland. You know why? Because every time anyone dies, the camera zooms out and you can't see people the stocks, because the stock ends. Yeah. The stocks yeah. are in the way. I hate that. <laughs> and you play Didn't they beta test that, Nintendo? <laughs> you play Green Fox and, like, Green Fox on Dreamland to me is hell I would hard switch to colors. Yeah. It's like, dude, like, I'll play Green one time, like, bro. Where am I? Wispy's like <laughs> blowing. I'm like, yo, oh, I'm like. Especially if you're double fox and you're oh, the light yeah. colored yeah, one. Yeah. Like, it's all bad. Green you is might the least use color in yeah. teams. Yeah. yeah. I, I'm okay with uh, the thing for me with teams is I really like when there is a red team. No, in yeah, other words, a red team has to be red played, versus yeah. blue or red versus green. I don't care who I am, but I don't like green versus blue. There's oh, too yeah. many states like Yoshi's mm-hmm. in Dreamland. It's like the grass into the sky, and like green versus blue. Sometimes I can't tell who's my teammate. Dude, my yeah, opponent. no, green, Absolutely. green, blue. I don't know if you guys feel this. Green, blue on Battlefield, just like fucks. Me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, like every time I'm like, bro. isn't that also like a color blindness thing? Yeah, like, it some could people be. Can't, could literally be, yeah. can't see the difference. Like I can yeah, see yeah. it, but it's like. Sometimes I question myself. I'm like, damn, what color am I like? <laughs> yo, I was like, yeah. some, yo, like, I'll ask the team, like, yo, can one of you guys just, like, Sweet. or, like, I'll just go red. I'll ask my yeah. teammate, like, yo, let's just go red. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just, yeah. I don't know. Red is such a, like, vibrant color in Melee. Because a lot of the colors in Melee, it'll be one color, but it's really not that. So, like, right. you know how, like, Sam is, is supposed to be red, but she's orange. orange or, like, yeah. Peach yeah. is supposed to be red, but she's pink. Like, yeah. stuff like that. Red Fox isn't quite red either. He's more He's orange. Orangey. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so we're going to take a look at the bracket. We finally have it up. Let's go. Okay. Uh, okay. And here it is. Ooh. Okay, so this Starting is also off. some insight on, hey, by the way, look at that. Mango's actually Mango playing. Actually oh, okay. Playing. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I had some bad intel. And <laughs> uh, I'm surprised to see Hbox going in, actually. So it's Plup and Hbox are the two uh, players on uh, Plup Club that are that are going yeah. in. Plup and Hbox, not Plup yeah. and Wizzy. Which, uh, you know, that makes sense. Um, yeah. but that's going to be the first match, Hungry Bucks versus Axe. What do you guys got? That is a tough call because uh, I go for Axe. Probably I Axe. Dude. I mean, Axe <laughs> is definitely the favorite, but if Hbox gets carried by that puff enough, right? Yeah, that's true. You know? Axe has some answers though. Like he could take some stocks with Youngling. That's true. Yeah, actually. Yeah, Would yeah. Not? I, I I think uh, Axe probably got that one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. He could just whittle him down with Young Link, and yeah. then if there's like a stock left, then he could probably just go Pikachu, and his Pikachu does really well versus his jig, so. Yeah. yeah. I yeah. think it all depends on when Hungry Box pulls the Puff, pulls out. The puff out. Yeah. yeah. So he, well, if he starts with Puff, it's going to be like, it, it'll change the dynamic of yeah. that crew yeah. battle versus if he puts him in the middle. Oh, and they're, they're getting right into it. Yeah. They're getting right yeah. into it. Yeah. Hey, yeah. don't forget about uh, Hungry Box's nest either. Yeah, it's a dangerous yeah, nest. Yeah, the yeah. Bumblebee, Bumblebee nest. Yeah. Bumblebee nest. Yeah. yeah, it's actually like not. It's a, uh, it's it's, I, like I watch a lot of Hbox's like secondaries and they they look to me like, 
unpolished. Like, it's like, here's a smart player, but, like, he doesn't, like, move as nice as, like, the other Fox and Falcons do. Right. But when I watch his nest, his nest is actually very clean. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Like, he's actually, like, moving and grooving. With his nest is clean. It's just, it's just nest. It is just nest. <laughs> I, I don't know. Some, I just... I think I have a bias towards Ness. I just think he's like way worse. Than you he think you is. devalue him? You think he's like worse you know than how DJ feel, like how you feel about Zelda? Yeah. I, like yeah. you feel that way about I, Ness? Yeah, I don't think Ness is the worst character, but I just I just think he's really bad. Did you okay. see these characters are starting with? Yeah, Link <laughs> versus see. Mario. Did I see that right? Ooh. Oh, Ooh. H box Link. Okay. Oh, the big box. <laughs> no, you got it. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Nice. <laughs> Xbox Link. Look at that. All right. Interesting. Hey, everyone forgot about the box tag, by the way. You guys remember the box yeah, tag? Yeah, yeah. Back in the, the day. Box oh. tag. Everybody was wearing the box tag in like 09. Mario versus Link. I give it to Mario here. Mario yeah. has a chain grab on Link. Do a big combo, especially doing up tilt into up air. It's a yep. four smash, you know, stuff like that. Yep, yep. <laughs> he got the, <laughs> <Look at that. laughs> the high eyes right there. Yeah, <laughs> off that. So what? <laughs> Definitely off something. <laughs> and they're starting <laughs> off on FD. Ooh, yeah. This is so good for Mario. He's like, I got to yeah. fight, bro. <laughs> I think this matchup in general is already good for Mario. FD is yeah, definitely it is. not. I not think, I think this matchup, that was a hot take. I think it's stage dependent. Because the thing is, it's if it was young Link, it will be different. Yeah. But it's Link. Link is so Mario's slow. too fast yeah. for him. Yeah. You think yeah. so? And Fireball is ah, really yeah. like, okay, you got all those projectiles TJ, do you think that there are matchups that Link is better than young Link in? Hmm. Yeah, I believe so. Let's see. Actually, wait. I have all the characters right I think it's, right. I I would think say it's like, this one. I would say Marth. <laughs> Marth. Yeah, I was going to say I think Link does better against Marth. Marth is Marth. like the yeah, only Marth one. Yeah, Marth for sure. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys think he does better against the Spaceys? Hey, Tove. Uh, Samus. 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 Yeah, for sure. Hugo chimes no. in. He says Link does better against Samus. Yeah. yeah. I can see that. Yeah. I, I vouch. I vouch. Oh, Link okay. hits and kind of combos harder a Damn, lot. Damn, I'm shocked. Axe. Started here, yeah, yeah. I think this is one of the better stages for Link. Yeah, yeah that's true. Yeah. Um, Hbox is starting surprisingly solid. Yeah. 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 See, platforms Ooh. is really hard for Mario to deal with. It's right. just like in this match, I just remember playing like against Germ, Hello with Doc. Obviously, Mario's different. Ooh. I just feel like, dude, the bombs, bro. Like, yeah, like Young Link has the speed, but. Link still got the same moves, but with like a fire down there, and like yeah. he's such a heavy body, bro. Like it's you, the chain grab. Ooh, ooh, yeah. ooh, and he didn't meet you. The chain grabs yeah. are flames. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, but like sometimes I think killing Link is annoying. That makes sense. You know, yeah. just yeah, because he can just make it. Like his recovery is a little better. He's got a longer grapple for sure. Yeah, but like obviously the speed thing. Like Axe is definitely running around his shield. Right. And then yeah. the chain grabs. Ooh, wow, tricks. Right? Interesting. What was the move Axe did? Did he do turn around up tilt there? Yeah. Yeah. Up, up he had a shield from Link is not not very fast. Not a very fast out of shield option. Uh, no. It's Yo, good punish um, though. DJ, do you know of the two Ooh. Young Link and Link, like whose boomerang's better? Whose boomerang is better? Yeah. Uh Young Links. Oh, young okay. Links, I think. Yeah. yeah. Young Links bombs are better too. They shield stab easier. Mm -hmm. And they combo yeah, them down uh, here. Yeah. yeah. See what, oh, oh the, the boomerang. boomerang on the way back. You're getting a lot of damage off this boomerang, oh. by the way. How much damage does the boomerang do if you smash through it? I can't believe he went up to challenge that downer. That was very scary for Axe. <laughs> Link's boomerang? I think. Like does it max do like 10? hit. I think it's seven, 16 or 17. Link's oh, really? Oh, young Link's hits harder. It's like My 18 Lord. or something. Yeah, it's Good crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. crazy. The, the boomerang has like a certain sweet spot, though. Like, if, yeah. you, if you throw the boomerang early, you like pop up mad face. high, like yeah. whereas like if you throw it late, he, it'll just love tap you like yep. you right, know. yeah, huh? So, so you the wanna, speed it, at which it's going, right? Like mm -hmm. if you're, dude, man, Styles or Herman, Germ would like he would wait for me to come at him and then just throw the boomerang right in front of me. I'd pop up, dare, yep. I'm dead at like seventy. I'm like, bro, yeah, that's a true combo. Yeah, yeah. it's just like. Wow. Yeah, I never really realized that about boomerangs. Yeah, yeah. nah, boomerang is it's a good, it's definitely a good like. On floaties, it's like an amazing pop-up for both Link and Young Link. Yeah. Especially Young Link. Just because Link can, Young Link can, uh, uh -oh. for oh. Oh. Definitely meant to do that grounded. Yeah. Okay. Right, that's like an even match. Yeah. Oh. Almost, yeah. <laughs> Went for that bomb dare. 
Ooh, Ooh cook. That wave dash back. <laughs> yep. That's so good with Mario. Wave dash back forward smash. Oh, yeah, that really is. It so actually good. has so much range. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's almost as much range as Mars 4 smash. Uh, so far. Uh, oh, uh, wow. <laughs> Let the smash attack swoop. <laughs> Let him fly. Yeah. That jump there is actually th that that right there from Link is Ooh. a good tune. Oh, oh yeah, so, so, oh, that so like though. Link's yeah. Link snare, when you have like a after the after the animation, there's a hitbox that yep. comes yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you gotta watch out for that. I don't know what it's actually called, but I don't know, man. I have a history of just getting bodied by Link. Yeah. <laughs> so like I just thanks I've Germ. Been, yeah, thanks Germ. The German Link too. He bodied me Ooh. like at air. Remember? Yeah, 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 I you just learn a lot about the character. Oh, oh the German link. Yeah, oh, yeah. I got confused no, for a second. Of, I was both like, of them. <laughs> both you of just them. said that though. I, I, I know. I've lost every link possible. But yeah. Link's got oh, okay, Hardy Box. Oh, oh. Yeah. oh. That oh my god. god. It was a pixel off. Yeah. Um Yeah, Link's got some stuff, man. He yeah. just like like you guys were saying earlier, he's just he just can't move. Like his my blood. Yeah. Like once you right. outrun him, he just Kinda can't do anything. Ah! Oh, that's he went for that yeah. Ain't, there he oh, there it is. Yeah. Wait, he, he nice still has to Oh, but okay. Oh, so no. Axe Axe Axe. Died Axe. Mario has a very similar recovery to Mark, where you can do the far up B, which you won't go as high, right. and then the regular up B, which you go super high. Yeah, he yeah. did. He did the, the the like horizontal. The one. horizontal yeah. one. Yeah. That's how he died his first stock too. Yeah, he did the I saw horizontal that. And I did notice it looked lower. Because Mario has one of the best magnets in the game to grab the ledge. Yeah. He'll grab it from. Super deep. Can um, well Mario like, do you struggle with um? Because I I struggle with this as Mario, but I don't know if it's me or the character. Because like Doc, you can kind of ride the wall. I feel like Mario, you can do what you just said, but like riding the wall is harder. Or maybe it's it's just different, obviously. But I don't know if you struggle with like, you know, like say you're on Yoshi's and you just kind of ride along the wall because you have to to get the wall jump. Yeah. Like is that in general that first part hard for you? So no. Nah. Yeah. Just, nah. Yeah, that's probably just. I mean, me. you could do the up B cancel too. Yeah. <laughs> with Mario and the wall jump. Yeah, 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 he, he could have done that right there if, yeah, he's, he, if he was. If he thought of it. Yeah. He probably just thought he was gonna grab it. Maybe he so. tried. <laughs> no, I actually might have tried. Um, I actually don't know how to do it. Yeah, that being said though, wall. Hbox is link. Not bad, yo. Yeah. I was, not bad. I was yeah, very not surprised. Not bad. Yeah. Kind of came out of nowhere. The platforms definitely helped them out there. Yeah. Okay, so they strike. Uh, so wild it's, it's only yeah. one stock. Uh, is this right? Okay, so I think the way it works is the incoming person uh, gets a... No, the, the person who's already in gets a ban once the incoming person picks their character, right? And then they counter pick? Yeah. Dude, uh, I wish I knew this See, matchup. I predicted that he had a mutual plane with Taj all the freaking yeah, time. Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah. Ooh. And start DJ, quick. you know this matchup at all? Yeah. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. who would, uh, <laughs> I legitimately just don't know. Um, yeah, what, once Mewtwo's in there, he just has all this pressure on Link. Like, Link needs the Nair space. Is not bad. Right. Yeah. He's getting a lot. He's racking up damage. Yeah, Nair yeah. shields. Oh. Yeah. oh! Yeah, Nair Force shields that very okay. easily. Especially versus Link. Yeah, one more of those. I love how Mewtwo has two forward smashes. Yeah, it looks like me too. The only character in the yeah. game who's down smash only covers oh. one direction. Dude, I feel like Link oh, cannot yeah. handle uh, characters with weird jump patterns. Yeah. It just seems yeah. Like it. You just have to set up a lot of traps with Link to try to like wall out Mewtwo. Yeah, but right. once he's in there with those nares, maybe, yeah. yeah, and he gets grabs, he could down throw tech chase you. Yeah, it's, it's bad news bears. <laughs> Is Mewtwo's down, through te down throw tech chase real? It depends on the character. Well, like Brandon said, game one didn't really matter. <laughs> so now yeah, dude, I feel like, yeah, game two is where it's like, just counter pick advantage, yeah. honestly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Unless you get body game one, like, yeah. which usually doesn't happen. So. It's usually pretty even because no one wants to use their trump card that yeah, early. Right. Doc Mewtwo. Interesting, man. I wish I knew knowledge on this one, Doc but I really don't. destroys Mewtwo. I was going to say, I yeah. feel like this is probably this bad. Is right bad. Yeah. They're going to Yoshi. Yeah, I don't okay. know. But I mean, Mewtwo isn't that great Mewtwo's on super stage. light. Yeah, he's super yeah. light. This is yeah. like one of his worst days. Doc, yeah. if you DI down smash away, for example, or like you get forwarded at like 70. 
Dog, dog yeah. is scary, like, Dog's randomly. The powerhouse. Yeah. Yeah. Since Mewtwo's so floaty, uh, jab, down, smash is like a true combo. Yeah. Unless they crouch cancel it, of course. Never seen the H Doc before. Yeah, H Doc is actually H moving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the H, H, H Doc. H Doc. H -Doc. H -Doc. <laughs> Dr. Box. But yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm so far already impressed with H Box because I've never seen his Link or his Doc, and they're both looking they're really They're both sweet. wavy. Yo, yeah. my man Hungry Box is not throwing a single pill. That's how you know he's just yeah, trying yeah, to scrap. Yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> She'll drop four dirt onto him. Nice. He's like, you see me in these trenches. <laughs> Still alive. It is hard for the oh, Mario nice. Brothers to get down and to recover versus Mewtwo, though, as we just saw. Yeah, yeah. That that's the sense. one advantage that Mewtwo has. Oh! 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 The oh! momentum from the cape didn't let him wave dash forward, so then he ended up slipping off. Yeah. Did he, did turning him around have anything to do with it either? Yeah, that's how he how he ended up SD because of the momentum of getting cape. Because when you get cape by Doc, it pushes you a little right. bit further. <laughs> <laughs> wow, if they nair at each other, even though Dr. Mario has his leg out, his leg is so short and stubby that Mewtwo's nair just wins. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, he has to down air. Down air's yeah. really good with Down air's oh. like, almost yeah. like destroyed. The cool thing yeah. about Mewtwo in this match, at least on this stage, he can could, he could up throw off the top at a certain percent. Yeah. yeah. It might be a little higher than expected, but right now it'll probably work. Yeah, yeah. Not right now it'll probably kill, yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. here. And oh. yes. Oh, that would have killed sooner. Look how he yeah, you, yeah, 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 you died the, dumb early. The floatier <laughs> yeah. that you are, uh, the higher chance that you'll die from Mewtwo's up throw. If you're a fast right. baller, you can live for a long time yeah, even yeah, at 150. Yeah. yeah. Only Same thing, logic with both. What makes players. like Doc really good in these situations, like as a character, Ooh, yep. is yeah. like <laughs> not necessarily his neutral or even his punish. It's the fact that Doc is like really good at high percents, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, ah, Doc is true. so good at, like, post 100. It's like, because he still kind of has the same thing, but you can't really hit confirm on him. So you can't really whiff moves out because they do nothing. Right. And then trying to edge guard him. Well, obviously, Mewtwo has a better one, but, like, it's still hard for most characters. Yeah. 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 So I can see why, like, they put Doc where they put him. See, it's like, Hungry Box, he's, if he doesn't get grabbed, he's just going to live forever. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah, he wanted it. Yep. Yeah, that's it. He gets a double. Oh, oh that was it. Oh, thank you. Damn. Yo, hard to watch. Here. The H doc though. The H doc. I've seen him on the, on his net play going oh, okay. in. Yeah, that was a bad <laughs> match. <laughs> yeah, that was a good counter pick from H. Yeah. yeah. The the SD by Axe too. Yeah, yeah. So let's see who has the Axe has left. That's pretty pretty big deal though that HBox kept two stocks now because he can actually do some more damage now with Doc. Yeah, I was so. about to say you I, you want to save the young link. Yeah, he yeah, wants to save yeah. it for um for, yeah, for Puff. Puff. Yeah. Puff. But this yeah. is the thing, Doc does really yeah, well versus Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> Doc, yeah. Doc, Doc yeah. does beat P Pikachu. Bro. Doc is such a good pick from HBox. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, he wants I to kind of question MD? this. Honestly, yeah, right. Hey, this would be a good time for. for uh, I'm a little surprised Axe is putting in like Falco right now. His uh, top tier. I feel like he should. Yeah, he probably should go save Falco. His Pikachu. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. he probably he has Falco, Young Link, Pika left. We're assuming, yeah. right? Yeah. I mean, yeah. of course, Axe could still like two stock his Doc because who knows how good H Box is yeah. versus right, right, right. Pikachu. Yeah. I so think we'll that's see. what Axe is hoping for. Yeah. To just not lose any stocks here. Yeah. Yeah, pills is your saving grace here versus Pikachu. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, you could you could chain grab Pikachu too with Doc. Very hard to deal with. Yeah. And like the cross up there, like uh, the dock handles it pretty well. You just shield it, you're on the, then like usually they're in the corner. Oh, yep, you can oh. cape it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh. dock's cape does 12%. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. Yeah. Oh, wow. wow. Yeah. Outranged. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely smart on Axe's part to pick a low ceiling. Oh, yeah, no. for sure. Yeah. Not just yet. Can't do oh, down nice. here. Yeah, X really wants pretty nice this. here. This is the time where you want to see a pill or two. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you any pills. You, pills. Can't oh, slow, yeah, you can't slow them down otherwise. Oh, the oh, platform. Yeah. Wow. 
one throw fair will definitely kill. Yeah. Or just fair straight up. Oh, hurry about it. He's throwing out moves at this one. Right. <laughs> and my man's just, yo, yo, please get hit. Please get hit. Oh, he's living, though. Yeah, he is. Ledge. Yo, this is so important. Oh, he got oh, it. He got away with it. He got it. That stock is huge. Yeah. yeah. That was a big stock. I'm, Ax could have shielded that. I'm surprised that off of that ledge dash, he wasn't. Oh. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that was definitely <laughs> down throw offs, man. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Yeah, oh, Doc yo. racks damage pretty fast. He hits hard. Yeah, yeah he does. Yeah. Pills rack damage like crazy. Down smash. Yeah, 8% yeah, per really pill. pill. Yeah. 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 That 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 about does it. Yeah. Nice now, if you're a hungry doc. box, do you use another character's chip damage or do you just get use puff? And, uh, kind of depends who he has. It depends, it depends who he has. Yeah. yeah, I don't know who he has. Okay, oh, yeah, well. it makes just sense. Going right into it. He doesn't right want his other characters to, let's say, like get obliterated. Like, let's say if it's a bad matchup or something. Right, yeah, so he's yeah, like, yeah. let me just go my bread and butter. Yeah. You know, he's confident. Sense. Most likely, at worst, I'll take this with like a one stock or something. Yeah. Unless, unless Axe just plays out of his mind and beats his puff, then that's huge. Yeah. Because then he still has Young Link. I'm Axe, sure. Axe needs to at least take a lot of stocks. Like, Falco and Young Link both do fine against puff. Like, and if. If he takes if he takes H down to like one or two stocks, like it's not that bad. But yep. if he gets washed, it's really bad. Right. Yeah. yeah. If H Box ends at like three stocks in this match, that could that could be curtains already. Yeah. Yeah, yeah the thing with this matchup is it's, it's actually not a bad matchup for Pikachu. The only thing is that it's hard for Pikachu to set up the KO on Jay. Yeah. 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 It looks like really in this matchup when I watch Axe, it looks like there's almost hardly no way to get the kill without overextending, and then that's like where the 50-50 comes in. Because yeah. obviously if you get it right, you get the kill, but then like if you miss, you're like in the shittiest spot ever. Yeah. yeah. You, know? you guys ever think about how if if they programmed it so Pikachu could move out of his down throw like, oh! How did that, that even kill? Not kill right? If he could move out of his down throw spot. like yeah. three frames sooner, Pikachu would destroy Jigglypuff. You ever think about that? His down throw. Oh, because he, like he can, he can up almost smash. Yeah. combo it, but he yeah. can't. Yeah, yeah, he can almost. Out. Yeah, but true. if he can that's combo true. him off his throws, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, that, that would change the whole game. Yeah. 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 Pikachu kind of does have a kill setup at high percent. He can uh, up throw Thunder straight up and it'll kill on like... <laughs> does that actually stages. combo? Yeah. Okay, I remember he did that to him at Very MLG. Very Yeah, okay, that makes sense. They can just yeah. DI like out of the Thunder though, right? Like away from where you can do it. Oh, yeah, but, if you, but it's Jigs, and she's so floaty, she gets hit by Thunder ah, off the top. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or you could do a up air into immediate Thunder, too. But Interesting. Yeah. Wow. Oof. Yeah, see, oh. it's oh. like, it looks just what hard for, like, especially, like, the way Hermibox mixes up. He mixes up moves to where, like, he hits you, and he gets his hits, but then you're still out of range after he combos you. So, like, usually a lot of times people are, like, are counter hit, like, and especially Axe, he's like real counter hit heavy. Yeah. Like, Honey Box would do, say, like a drill. There it goes. Yeah. Oh. With the 6'9. Six 6'9 nine. Six <laughs> nine on the regular. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, um, Honey Box would like hit you to where he'll get his two hits in, then put himself at a good vantage point after. Right. Like, like yeah, say, yeah. if I combo people with Falco sometimes, I'll get my hits in, but then I'm at a bad vantage point, so then they yeah. can hit me immediately. But the box like that like like never happens when he hits you. Yeah, no. he's always the one threatening the back air in the next interaction or whatever. Right, it is, right? Yeah. it's like yeah. he's setting up his neutral while he's punishing you. It's actually crazy. Yeah, right. like right there. Like, see, he got his hit in. Oh, oh. it's crazy. The trade. Up to okay, rest. so most likely seeing the young link. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. wasn't too bad. I think Axe did what he wanted there, taking yeah, two. He took yeah. Two, yeah. But for a moment, it looked like he could have won it because yeah. he they, he tied it up. Yeah, he, he went like two stocks, two stocks, two. two stocks. Yeah. yeah, and then he kind of fell apart. But yep. yeah, not not too bad. This is actually still anyone's game. Yeah. Uh, I really don't know who H Box has left, so that's I think what it's going to come down to. Yeah. yeah. And, and Axe having a, a top tier still in play is actually a yeah. Big game. yeah yeah it's yeah. crazy. Yeah, because yeah, H Box has now used his. Green or red zone character or whatever, yep. which is the top tier, which yeah. is Puff. So, and I have to imagine that Doctor. So Doctor Mario, he, he had a four-point pick, which means that a lot of the picks that he could potentially have remaining is probably uh, Ness. It's got to be Ness. Low on Ness. Yeah, yeah, Ness yeah, probably, yeah, yeah. and, someone, and then else. someone else probably fairly low. Let me yeah. see what the the, the how do the, how do the points stack up here? Yeah. So uh, he used Jigglypuff and Doctor Mario, so you have five points to allocate. Out and he that. used Link. Yep. 
So yeah, so four points. Five, four. If Ness. Oh, he still had some, some options, actually. Oh, yeah. No, he could go all the way up to three. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He could have a Samus or something in play. <laughs> uh, so let's see. All right. Yeah, the young Link is out. Yep, Samus yep. is such a funny character. <laughs> a humorous character. Why is that? I, I just think everything about Samus is funny. It's true. Yeah. Just even the way she like moves around, she goes wah, 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 you know? Damn. I love that. It dies off the top. <laughs> yeah, That's crazy. That's weird. Right, so here we go. Hbox no stranger to this matchup. No, no, no. no. Oh, no. Axe doesn't Either play the matchup as annoyingly as Armada does. Either. Right. Axe actually likes. <laughs> yeah, he goes in. He tries to fight yeah. a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Dude, I remember the set they had at SmashCon, dude. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. It was super cool. Axe Armada. It was game. Or right, Axe Armada. Axe Hungry Box. Oh yeah, yeah. It was game five. Everything like this whole. Like, oh yeah. Young Link. Buff like. It was cool. working. Yeah. I thought he could up it. Yeah, I was looking for the up air. <laughs> oh, nice. Caught the, this is oh! oh. The, up, the low ceiling almost came in. Links would have killed. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> That's actually kind of scary for. You know, Hbox used like all his jumps. Oh, oh yeah, right. the pop down air. I said I got the mobility to set up that combo yeah. way easier than Link. You, uh, this stage is so good because it's like best of both worlds. You get the. Mobility to move around, but you still get the low ceiling KOs. Yeah. yeah. Oh, 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 I like it. <laughs> break the target strategies. Yeah, yeah, those are break the target <laughs> strategies. <laughs> this matchup is just, yeah. like, just too much going on. It's kind of like you could create a wall while still having the just movement to move puff or just move around puff. Yeah. Yeah. You can wall around and move around at the same time. That's like hella crazy. A lot of characters can't do that against Plo. Yo, Young Link is a good uh, uh, ledge jump. <laughs> it's Young Link, I feel like, especially with the way his axe playing, is the one character that sometimes can make Puff's jumps feel in like not as a threat like normal. You know how yeah. in some matchups, like you see Puff like just jump around all the characters' moves. It's like Young Link has an answer. To a, to a jump, to a puff that takes to the skies. Yeah, right. you can kind of police that a little bit. Yeah, yeah. That goes not super well right now because at this point, even if he lost another stock, he'd still be fine. Like yeah, for yeah. the yeah. purposes of what he's trying to do with this, so not too bad. He's yeah. doing great. Honestly, yeah. Like with regards to whatever hunger box is left, Young Link Falco is about as good as he could ask for. Like for, yeah, for two this, characters to combat stage, that. Yep. Yeah, those are two characters that will do well against Ooh. anything Hbox has left. Yeah. That's why That's even though Hbox is winning right now, I yeah. feel like Axe might still yeah. low key oh. be the favorite. Axe is taking his time. You can tell he wants to hold the stock. Hungrybox too, though. He's yeah. trying to take as much as he can. He really, Hbox is trying to play this really safe. He, yeah. he just wants to find some way to kill him. He really wants the stock. The stock is crucial. See, this, like the problem with characters like Puff, right? Because I know everyone talks about how like guy like Puff is, but like in situations like this, like this is Floaties in general, but especially Puff, like her tent comes really obvious, right? Mm -hmm. And you could tell Hungry Box is like, looking for the bear or the fair to knock down. Like yeah. mixing up with Puff is hard at this, like especially when you're over 100. Right. Wow, great recovery. Yeah. She's not a great yeah, comeback a, character. Right. Though, aside yeah. from the rest. Right. Like, obviously, yeah. in that, at that point, you couldn't rest, so. Yeah. Uh, Axe with three stocks. From Axe. Yeah. Well, Hurry Box still in the lead. So. Yeah. Ness is okay. coming in. Uh, Bumblebee so Ness. Ness. Gotta wonder who that, that mystery fifth character of H Boxes is, but that'll be his anchor. Yeah, that's actually pretty scary if he's going up against Falco. Yeah. Man. Yeah. If he can win this one, though, and then manage to take a stock off the Falco. Yeah. That yeah. could be big. Yeah. yeah that's but that's, some dirty that's hard to do. On spaces, yeah, man. that's true. Yeah. yeah. How about Ness? I feel like Young Link probably bodies Ness, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just like, just thinking about the way the characters work. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. you can't even <laughs> absorb his projectiles. Like, yeah. No. Yeah. Can Ness, uh, can he not side magnet? Can he not down B the. No. But nah, you know, with them? nah, you know how, like, lasers you can't. I think, like. Is like it because they're not energy? Or, yeah, yeah energy based. Oh, no. Energy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like even uh, box pills are energy. Yeah. Like. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah. Fireball stuff like that. Yeah. But like, t 
tangible, like like missiles, bombs, yeah, stuff yeah. like that. But oh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I love seeing Ness's up be used as like a counter okay. attack, like a move. Yeah. All right. It actually kind of sucks though, because if you use it to edge guard, it hits you back towards the stage, which is not great. Yeah. And this is the bane of, uh, of Ness, is the recovery. Dude, yeah. it's so bad. It's so bad, bro. Dude, yeah, I was well playing, bad. I was now playing Simna not too long ago. Shout out to Simna. Me too, actually. And like, I thought he was doing some good stuff, but it just was like, damn, I feel like this guy's outplaying me and just, he's just so limited. Like, <laughs> right. it's, like Ness has no range. Dude, the worst is like, if you, like, you, I take Ness to Yoshi's story. As a counter pick, and when they try to recover, they up B into the shy guys that fly in, and they just die. Right. Oh, oh wow. that actually killed. Wow. wow. That was Yo, nice. it's in the highlight trailer. <laughs> it's on ready. Let's go. Wow. Hbox slight lead right now, but he did start a stock up. So. Yeah. So yeah. it's it's really axes. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. I like those two oh, ones. Cancels. Yeah, the way H-Box is sneaking in his aerials is actually, oh, okay, he gets hit out oh, of that combo. Dude, yeah, you know what I've noticed from H-Box's ult in this session more than I've ever had? His, like, his neutral with all his characters just looks, in general, just looks way more polished. Yeah. Like, he's using platforms as a way to approach, just, yeah. like, finessing them on the ground a little bit. Yeah. Like, I don't know. He was edge canceling a ton with yeah. uh, Dr. Mario. Yeah. yeah, his Link did it a couple times, Link too. Link did, too, yeah. I think uh, another thing, too, is... Oh my god. He's, for whatever reason, compared to when I've watched HBox secondaries in the past, it looks like he's using all their aerials really well. Right. Kind of yeah. like how he does with Puff. With Puff, right. yeah. Obviously not quite to the same extent, Ooh. but. You know what I think yeah, it might be? I think guess. it might be Netplay. I think it it's the be. fact that because yeah. yeah, he's it. been streaming a lot, and yeah. so he's probably been practicing his lower tiers for. Uh, Makes sense. Yeah. Doesn't yeah. want to play Puff like all day for yeah. his stream. I've seen him like just go in on some boxes with Doc. Yeah. Like, I'm like, damn. His, he's got a good Ganon. That's probably his last pick. Oh, yeah, actually, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just thought about that. Yeah, yeah. That's Ganon's, bad news for him, though, because he's got Falco. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. That's Ganon's way. Yeah. Oh, nice. Good punish. Oh, yeah. punish. Perfect punish. <laughs> All right. That's the, the, the Wind Waker Ganon killer. He stabs him in the head. <laughs> the I, I hate being that commentator guy, but this last stock is so important. <laughs> no, it, 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 it does. Like, it's definitely going to Yeah. Hurt. Yeah. It's pretty huge. Yeah. Oh, the juggles. Right. Axe out here. Oh, man, another one. God, Link and Young Link, their up airs are actually oh, so good. Yeah. Right. <laughs> oh, so yeah. Good. Wow. Oh, that so up is trash. That was Jesus awesome. Guys. Nice yeah, shit done. So <laughs> you have all the time in the world right? to punish it. <laughs> Right, well, all of a sudden, this is rough. If they made yeah. Ness invincible during that, I think it'd be pretty good. There it is. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> or just like, you know how Fox has like that frame of like that invulnerability from the fire or like that hitbox? Like if Ness had something like that. Oh, like while he was starting his up. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just like him just standing in the air. <laughs> Or the, floating, funniest, I say. the funniest way to edge guard it by far is just jumping out and like taking the taking up the oh, yeah. So yeah. Funny. That's sad. He it's, just falls in yeah. like there. <laughs> like, it's like a. Aww. Aww. I always feel bad, but I also die laughing. I die laughing. Yeah. It's super hey, funny. Let's go out here. Yeah, so he does. Uh, he has the Ganon. Yeah, I mean, he's from Florida, man. That's like Ganon State. Oh, yeah. That's, that's true. Ganon. I kind of forgot that's about the that. Mecca yeah. 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 Um, Ganon and Falco is like, that's their thing. Ganon yeah. and Falco. And Falcon. <laughs> uh, oh, and Falcon days. now, yeah. yeah Falcon more, now, more, more yeah. recently. Um, more recently. Honestly, though, like Young, uh, Young Link does pretty good in this matchup, though. Yeah. I think Ganon does have chain grabs. That's true. Oh, yeah. Again? Oh, you oh, no, it packed. I see you, Hungry Fox. <laughs> see, that's what I'm saying, man. Hungry Fox would not have done that two years ago, bro. Yeah. Oh, he uh, wanted to go for a back here, but landed on the platform. That would have been it, right there. Oh. That crowds. Uh oh, it's the power levels. What does the scouter say about it? Axe's power level right oh. now. <laughs> oh, another one. That's the state number. Another one. Uh, another See, one. See, he actually beats yeah. Ganon's stomp. Yeah. <laughs> oh! oh! Good choice. Respect Sometimes that. you just gotta say, Respect. fuck it. Back. Damn. Respect. Man. Respect that. 
Like, yo, good. I'm out here, bro. Yo, I love good. that Ganon's got, like, oh, way bars. Oh, he has bars. Oh, that actually what? makes his way more interesting. <laughs> yeah, that that's, that's I'm glad it's not Falco. Yeah, it's yeah. actually doable. <laughs> oh, man. That yeah, changes everything. Yeah. yeah, that's true. He does. Oh, dude, I always, I always think it's so funny how there's this weird dynamic Martha has where Martha's, like, amazing, right? He's an amazing yeah. character. Right. He's one of the, like, probably two best characters in the game, I think a lot of people would say at this point. Mm -hmm. yeah. But... He struggles with some <laughs> mid-tier matchups that every other top tier just watches, like Link. Yoshi, yeah, Link, Yoshi, Ganon, Pikachu. Pikachu like every up. Marth player is like, ah, oh, I don't want to play a Ganon right now. That's kind of scary. Yeah. Dude, I think um, I always think. Oh my goodness. Ooh, that being Yo. said, oh, he actually uh, had he's starting off. Cool. Yeah. Oh my God. I always think of Marth and Falco of having kind of the same plight. Mm. Like, um. It's different, obviously. Right. But like, I know what you mean, though. They both, uh, they're very po like when they when they hit you, you you get washed, and like, they they can't really Damn. kill that well. They they're good. like, Mars more of a glass cannon than people think, bro. He is. I yeah. swear he is. He like, he, is. he dies really fast, bro. One time I. Yo, shout out to you, Mar. I shined him once and grabbed ledge, and he was at 13%. And he died. And I just grabbed a ledge, and I'm like, bro, that's ooh, that's not Sword that's thing. not okay. Like, All of that being said, though, everything that's happening right in front of us right now, Axe is actually just yeah, kind Axe of going putting off. it work. Oh, oh, okay. Interesting choice with the counter that's, there. Yeah, Should that's be the stock. I, mm -hmm. Yep, yep. I think Marth wins this, but Ganon. It's semi doable. Yeah, Ganon's got a beat fighting Mars chance. A lot, Ganon, so. yeah. Ganon's do beat. Yeah. Oh, oh, especially Seven if we got these. Yep, we got a di up. Yeah, Marth is like the best character who struggles with like the worst characters. Randomly. Yeah. 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 But I get it. It's a smart pick to have Marth instead of Falco because sometimes Falco gets janked. Yeah. By some yeah. Of yeah. yeah. Everybody Marth can a combo safer. spaces. Yeah. So you probably didn't want to deal with that. Marth could just, you know, wall out all these characters because they barely have options. Mm -hmm. True. Hbox not doing too bad though, especially considering oh, he got zero to right. death on the first. Oh. You hate to see that happen. Oh, forward throw, wave dash, forward, up tilt. Interesting. Yeah, that is interesting. Probably only works on DIM. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. I think if he had reverse up aired, it might have worked yeah. there. Oh, my. Yeah, oh, if he had converted off that, he could have gotten maybe a, maybe a kill. Yeah. Oh, nice like recovery. I just feel like the good things Ganon has in this matchup is just, like, the ability to crouch cancel, obviously. Oh, Johnny grab. And, uh... Depending on, especially Axe is a nair heavy Marth, and you can shield grab that. Yeah, yeah. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like uh, you can shield grab that a lot uh, versus uh, Marth. They nair a lot. So. Oh man, Hbox has given up the ledge a bunch. Yeah, Way finally finishes it though. Damn, that DI was amazing. Yeah, that was really good. Hbox could have four year though. Oh, oh that, that wasn't a temper. No. That, that looked kind of backstage oh, to me. No. That was insane. <laughs> I think he should. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, never mind. Yeah, he's like. still living. I think he should. Yeah. Oh, no. oh, that. <laughs> Fuck what I think. What an answer. <laughs> Tell him, Max. <laughs> if Hbox yeah. brings this back, that would be nuts, actually. That would be Up nuts. till net zero, I don't know about that one. But, ooh, oh, wait. Still got to okay. tell oh, him. Man. I thought he would go for it. Yeah. Just yeah. There. Yeah. He I thought he was just going to grab it. It's because Axe has been doing the stall, and now he's not. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Oh, no, oh no, no, this no. could be big. Okay. Back air, yeah. yeah. I would go out there instead of doing this because he's just going to make it. All right, he finally got what? on the ledge. That's the first Back time air. Hbox got on the ledge, and it immediately yeah. worked. So <laughs> hopefully he uses that again. Get on there. Yeah. Yeah. He's not grabbing ledge at all. Yeah. He's giving it up. Oh, no. Oh, like this. Oh. Well, look at not like this. And look at it. All right, it works so out. Axe moves by two stocks. Yeah. yeah, Axe moves forward. Nicely done. Yeah. Um, shout out to Hbox though. Yeah. Some surprisingly sick yeah. secondaries. Yeah. 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 He he his showed doc, up for sure. Yeah. Doc put that H doc. Yeah, H doc. Yeah. Shout out to H doc. Yeah. At Hungry Box, H doc. H -Doc. Right now. <laughs> yeah. Kudos to Axe though. I'm I wonder if it. Axe picked Marth because he figured most other people would be picking Fox from the top tiers. And so he wanted, like, the Marth counter pick kind of thing. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. Just kind of be right. Yeah, that's true. Because then he could have just went to FD. Right, right. Yeah. I guess yeah. unless they ban it, because I think there are bans. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not one sure. Strike. Yeah, that's yeah, there so. is one strike. I, I mean, no, I told, that's probably a good thing, because he probably didn't know he was going against Hungry Box initially. Right. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's yeah. probably accounting for, like, the whole bracket. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. Um, 
And I think Marth definitely ca covers more like potential bad matchups for his other characters it's a safer than Valco. Choice. Yeah, for, for sure. sure. Yo, do so. you guys know? Um, or is it like character lock for the entire like? Is that Axis team the <laughs> entire way, or can he, don't know. can he I switch? Think actually, during, yeah. cause I feel like that would sure. be too broken if you could just keep switching. Uh, yeah, that would be. Over. Like kind of. each round, I mean. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, I feel like that's kind of Yeah, fair. I think it's yeah. – if, if you got the switch. Yeah, hey, production, did you hear the question? Yeah. Rob? Rob. The God. But, uh, yeah, but Up uh, next, though, we got Armada, Wesh, Bowers. Wesh, Bowers. Wesh is a 